You know, my God, that my one desire has ever been to love you alone. Your glory has been my one ambition. Your love has gone before me from the days of my childhood. It has grown with me and now it is an abyss so deep that I cannot sound it. Love calls to love and mine longs to fill the abyss of yours in its flight to you. But it is not even a drop of dew lost in that sea. If I am to love you as you love me, I must borrow your love. I can find peace no other way. I want Jesus so to draw me into the flames of his love, so to make me one with himself, that he may live and act in me. I feel that the more the fire of love inflames my heart, the more I shall say, draw me, and the more swiftly those who are round about me will run in the sweet odor of the beloved. Jesus has chosen to show me the only way which leads to the divine furnace of love. It is the way of childlike self-surrender. The way of a child who sleeps, afraid of nothing, in its father's arms. Jesus, my love, I have at last found my vocation. It is love. Love proves itself by deeds, and how shall I prove mine? The little child will scatter flowers, whose fragrant perfume will surround the royal throne, and in a voice that is silver-toned, she will sing the canticle of love. <laughs>